So in today's YouTube video, guys, I'm going to show you a Kazdov 762 build that is a three-shot kill at any range here in Modern Warfare 2. Now, this build is very nice. you got to try it out. So if you guys are new, enjoy today's video. Make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel with notice on so you don't miss any more videos. But anyways, let's hop right into it. I haven't used the AK-47 in such a long time. Did I just find something with this AK? What the heck? I am scooting like this, kind of. <laughs> what? This is kind of funny. That is so funny. This is so weird. Yo, Flip. Welcome, my man. How we doing? Philip, is that says Philip? Yeah, I'm, I'm bugging, I'm bugging. Yeah, we still over here, man. I don't know where these guys are. Yeah, they're over there. It was it my my left monitor is kind of dark, so I can't really see, and your name is dark. My bad. Where is everybody? My dead silence went away too. Shit. You're gonna ego chow, aren't you? No. Yeah, thank you, my man. Yo, Danny, shout out to you, my man. Thank you for watching the video. All right, let me get over here. Yo, chat. I think I found a new movement, like, like a new movement glitch or something like that. I mean, it's kind of, it's weird. I don't know how to really, I really don't know how to like describe it. But I mean, I, I think it's, I mean, this is kind of weird. Describe it, but I mean, it, it, it's weird. It's weird. Yeah, like what's it, uh, Danny? I'm gonna try to start. I'm gonna try uploading more top fives. Uh, I, I feel like I don't know. I feel like you guys like them. We're doing good with this uh, cast off right now. I mean, we're doing pretty good. Yeah, but I think I found like a movement thing. It's like weird. I don't know if it's a placebo or not, but I feel like I'm moving pretty quick with it, doing this. It's weird. Like, if I do it right, I feel like I'm like tack sprinting while I'm like aiming down sights. Oh, we got our MGB already. That's good. The Lockman class, yes, sir. I, I know a lot of people. I know people would use the shotgun class, but nobody's really hit my uh, bouncing Betty yet. Yeah, this is so weird. Like, I feel like I'm moving pretty quick like this. I don't know. Like, it's like I'm tack sprinting while aiming down sights. I don't know. It might be a placebo. I don't know. I don't know. It feels it feels weird, though. All right, let's call the dead silence in. I'm dead. Dang, bro. I gotta put this sentry gun down. Dear lord, dude. 
Ah, uh, I'll just pop it down right here. I'd like to get another nuke. Sentry guns getting. Oh my god, they're all right here. Thank god. That was right there. I'm gonna pop that down right there. Alright. Pop that right there. This guy's looking at me. Not anymore. That was a fail. I don't even know if I got it over on the other side. How you doing, uh, Suk? How you doing, man? I need some ammo. Alright, we got some ammo. Good. Dead silence. Yeah, they're all over here. On the Orion ground right now, how close are you? No shot. Blackbeard got me, man. Shit. Well, at least we're getting another VTOL. Oh, thank God I got him. Battle Rage is not going to work constantly, my friend. Oh my lord. Oh, you, you'll get you'll get Orion quick, I'm sure. Like, was it if you didn't know, uh, once the new DLC weapons come out, you can do those instead of doing uh, the launchers. And like, well, actually, realistically, you don't even have to do the launchers right now. You could just skip them and do all the DLC weapons if you want to do another sniper. But. If you want to just do a another assault rifle and uh, um, like a knife or something, like a melee weapon, you can do those. Those are pretty easy. All right, we're on a relentless. We're about to get another nuke. Was it for me? I remember when I was going for Orion, I really, I really thought the launchers were gonna be bad, cause I had nightmares with the, um, what is it called? I had nightmares with the, uh, the javelin in Modern Warfare 19. So I really didn't want to do them again. But it was actually easy this year. I don't know how, but I should be close to this new. I just don't know. Sentry gun's going crazy right now, for real, too. He's got me a kill chain. A kill chain sentry gun. I'm like one or two kills off. I need that. Okay, where? They're over here. Bro. There it is. Double nuke. Hey, I don't care. Hot potato got me. Loser.
Florida Mutineer skin. Definitely relatable right there. He is blind. And big man got us. Dang. We're gonna have to call this nuke here in a minute. Dude, bro. Pooh Bear got us. Yeah, I'm gonna have to call it in on this hill. I gotta call the nuke in. Ah, I didn't get it off. Oh my god, but 122 kills. We got a double nuke. Let's go. Alright, let's get it. Let's get it. Where are they at? The hip fires are good on this weapon. Dang, bro. Oh my god. Got the Overwatch Hilo. Hey, that guy just like locked on to me. My guy just locked on to me. Drop shot at me too, bro. Jesus. He has an RPG. You gotta be careful with that guy. My guy's using an RPK. A Warzone RPK class clubs. And that was the Lockman 762 that just got me. Awesome. I am blind. Dang, bro, this guy is like gonna cause problems this game. This gun is too good, bro. Got the advance as well. Get out of here, boy. Oh, we have a guy on the other team streaking. Okay. I do not want to bang, bro. I was so close to a nuke. Bro, the veto got me again, dude. Damn. My teammates are leaving and we're winning by a good margin. Well, not really, not a margin. We are slaying out though in KC. I do like. I think I think shipment like when there's like a permanent like you know like shipment 24/7, shoe house 24/7 and everything. I actually think KC goes to 150. I believe. I don't think it goes to 100. I think so. I'm not sure though. I'm not really too sure. All right, Vitol's gone. Thank God. I couldn't snap on him fast enough, dear lord. Confirmed. Yeah, 
This guy is awful. Not really sleepy. I don't. I don't play the game for 800 hours a day. I mean, it'd be probably different if I played this like you know 10 plus hours a day, but. I hate how I hate how that uh I hate how when you're using your knife you try to switch over and like quickly aim at someone. It doesn't it doesn't kill them instantly. Yeah, it goes to 150. Just killed me. Got another VTOL, man. Dear Lord. Skill based matchmaking is ruining games. Uh, yeah. If there wasn't skill based, I would like definitely be like run with a, like a six man team every day, just kind of like chilling and you know, but unfortunately, there's. We don't. We don't get that anymore. I mean, you could, but I mean, it won't be as enjoyable. I need this. I need this veto to go away. Just got another Overwatch. That's good. Let's see the guy. Dang, bro. How many kills are at? One hundred eight. I will say that the hip fire on this is actually really good. Get beamed. I don't even wanna I don't even wanna know. Oh my god, that's Dang it goes to a hundred, that's When Casey went to 150, that was so fun. We're at 122 right now. I almost snapped on that last dude. The hip fire, is, the hip fire on this weapon is actually really good. I got five bullets. Oh, I didn't get the knife line, bro. Yo, lasting. What's good, dog? Dang, bro, they're shooting at the wall and everything. I think we're about to lose, though. Dang, bro, we lost. <laughs> bro, 137 kills, though. I only had four people on my team, but hey, GG, let's go. All right, so now it's time to hop into our build for the Kazdolf 762, and we're going to start with attach number one, which is going to be the Talon 5 suppressor. Now, this can help with sound suppression, bull velocity, damage range, and recoil smoothness. Now, this attachment here is just going to keep us quiet. We're staying stealthy, so it is going to help you stay alive to go on those nuke streaks, higher kill streaks, and everything like that. Your bull velocity is going to help your bullet travel faster and air to hit our targets faster. You have that damage range for getting a little bit more damage and a little bit more range, so our bullets are traveling further and also. Also, our bullets are doing more damage at a longer distance and then you have that recoil smoothness it's just going to make the weapon more smooth when firing with a little bit of recoil control so this is a very helpful attachment for number one now for attachment number two guys we have the edge 47 grip on now this can help with aiming auto stability and recoil stabilization now with this attachment here in the suppressor it's a very good combo we're getting recoil smoothness and recoil stabilization it's going to make the weapon so much easier to control so you need to have this on for attachment number two for attachment number three guys we have the demo x2 grip now this can help with recoil control now if you think you can control your weapon really good at longer distances and everything like that you can use the true tech grip to make yourself more aggressive aim down sight speed your sprint to 
fire speed your handling's going up but this weapon is pretty balanced you know the damage range the fire rate the range the accuracy the recoil control the mobility and handling it's all balanced here so it's either if you want to be more aggressive or do you want your weapon to be a little bit more easier to control at those further distances it's up to you but honestly i am using the demo x2 grip for attachment number three now for our next attachment guys we have the Kazdov Rama stock now this can help with aim walking movement speed and sprint speed so this attachment here is going to allow us to run faster around the map we can flank people faster get to objectives faster be more aggressive be in people's faces and also it gives us aim walking movement speed so when aiming down sights we're strafing left to right a lot faster here and just in general moving faster when aiming down sights so if you're getting into those gunfights moving while aiming down sights it's going to help you a lot more when not getting hit as much so definitely having this on is going to be very helpful. Now for our final attachment guys we have the FSS OV laser now this comes with aim down sight speed sprint to fire speed and aim accessibility very popular attachment here on the channel it helps us be more aggressive we're getting a little bit more accuracy a lot more handling which is going to be very helpful shooting faster off a sprint aim it down sides faster this attachment here it's just going to help us get more kills now it's time to tune our attachments for the Kazdov 762 and we're going to start with the stock here now we're going to put our aim walking movement speed at 2.40 and our aim down sight speed at 4.00 just maxing them out here aim down sight speed is going to be a lot faster helping us with handling and our aim walking movement speed is going to be maxed out giving us a little bit more mobility aim Aim walking movement speed is going to be so much faster. It's going to be very helpful. Now for the demo X2 grip, we're going to put our sprint to fire speed here at 0.26. So we're shooting faster off the sprint, being a little bit more aggressive. And also our aim down sight speed is going to be at 0.45. So our aim down sight speed is pretty quick now. Now for the underbarrel for the Edge 47 grip, you want to put our aim walking movement speed at 0.40, maxing that out. So our aim walking movement speed and our mobility is going to be so much faster. And then our recoil stabilization is going to be at 0.65. So our weapon is so much easier to control. The recoil control is going up. And then for our final attachment, we have the Talon 5 Suppressor. We're going to max out that bull velocity so our bullets are traveling faster and air to hit our targets faster and giving us a little bit more range. And then we have our recoil smoothness here at 0.81. So our weapon is more smooth and it's so much easier to control. But guys, you got to try the class up out. Let me know in the comment section. What do you guys think? Let's see who can get the highest kill game in the comment section. And also, if you want to know the rest of the class it up, being a little annoying, we have the combat knife that could run faster around the map. We have the stun grenade, the proximity mines, our perk package. We have double time, scavenger, resupply, and bird's eye. And then we have dead silence, so we're more quiet, being stealthy, and everything like that. But anyways, try the class about. Again, let me know in the comment section what is your highest kill game. If you like the build or not, let me know. But guys, thank you so much for watching. You guys stay safe, and I'll see you on the next one.